I've watched over 180 agencies compete in new business uh, pitch presentations. And I've sat in a room after all the presentations are done with the client and listened to them talk about what happened. It's probably going to be very disappointing to you that it's almost never happens that they talk about the ideas that are being presented. Because to them, the brief is just a drill, a way of creating an excuse to have agencies present so they can make apples to apples comparisons. What they do talk about is the people. I really want to work with that Maryland. I don't think I like that Steve, etc. They're talking about the people. It's no different than when you hire someone. The resumes may act as a screen, of an objective screen of some sort, but mainly you interview those last three or four people and you make the decision instinctually. And that's the same for agencies. The implication of this is it matters who you put on your pitch team. You always put the best actors from the agency on the pitch team because that's going to make the difference. Clients have decided they're going to have one blind date and get married. It's stupid, but that's what they do. So you need to have your best people out there presenting, and they need to be prepared, and they need to rehearse. If you can't rehearse three times, don't pitch the account. It's not worth it. Rehearsal is absolutely critical, and only the best actors go on stage.